Maglev trains are maintained and propelled on their tracks by magnetic fields. Maglev is short for magnetic levitation. The principle of magnetic levitation and propulsion was developed as early as 1930, but it was not until decades later that it was implemented in practice. Although Germany was the leading developer of Maglev, the project lost government support, and it was therefore China that operated the first Maglev line in 2003. The world's first magnetic train connected Shanghai's business district and Pudong Airport. The train covers a distance of 30 kilometers in 7 to 8 minutes, occasionally reaching speeds of 430 kilometers per hour. Due to their operating principle, maglev trains require separate and continuous tracks. One option is to build elevated tracks supported by 5 to 6 meter high concrete pillars. The principle of magnetic levitation originates in the principle of the operation of electric motors. There are several ways to implement this principle in practice. One way is to place magnets on the concrete guideway, that is, at the bottom of the guide rail, as well as at the lower part of the trains, that is, at the skirt. In this synchronous linear motor system, the first acts as a stator, and the latter acts as a rotor. The current lifts the train up and propels it forward. The guide magnets fixed to the skirt, the built-in sensors, and the control computers ensure that trains do not touch the tracks while in motion. Although the principle of magnetic levitation is very simple, it is very costly to implement. Yet, it is a fact that the new maglev technology with trains running quickly and quietly without wheels, axles, and bearings has marked a new era in the history of the railway.